take it. It'll be helpful one day. Why are you helping me? Because you're the most important one. Good luck. Wait, do you know who I am? Then tell me. You'll find your answer at the end of a long journey. Farewell. Lynn, come on, get up. Listen to me. The captain would want you to pull yourself together. This is all your fault. You shouldn't have forced me to come here. Lynn, don't you see what the captain is trying to do? Look at these people. They need us. They depend on us. Mother. <laughs> Enemies! The forest tribe is coming! Oh. <sighs> What are you waiting for? Get out there and fight! Four of them. Take a look at that armor. It looks pretty decent. It would be a shame to let it go to waste. Great! We didn't properly gear up while we were leaving so quickly. Hey, hey, Captain. Good news. I totally took care of that pesky Boris tribe for you. However, judging by their numbers, I'm guessing their base is somewhere nearby. You are all so pathetic! Why did you choose such a dangerous place to evacuate to? This is your mess, so fi- If you're so worried, then why don't you help us with our scouting? We can't. Our job is to protect these refugees. That's what I thought. We'll scout the area then. You and your men can just stay here and relax. Len, please help. The people who went out to get food yesterday haven't returned. Something must have happened to them. Let's get going. Lynn, I'll come with you. Okay, Finay. I won't leave you alone again. But you have to stay by my side, because it can be dangerous. So, she's the girl. Lynn, I'll come with you. I can make myself of use to you by treating your injuries. Okay. A priestess from the saintly order should be very helpful. <sighs> Benay, what's wrong? Are you okay? I think I remember something. Hey, that's great. Does that mean your memories are coming back? I think so. I hear something. I hear a voice. Loki, looking for Rudy isn't what's important right now. It's protecting these people. Are you okay, kid? Tell me what happened. My dad and I were looking for food. And then the forest tribe showed up. My dad tried to get their attention and lure them away to save me. And now he's... I'll go and save him. Don't cry and stay here. What's this? My goodness. We were too late. Damn it. We weren't fast enough. We couldn't save him. I'm so sorry. We were too late. Dad, no! <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> Truly, forgive me. Dad! He hasn't been eating much. He appears to be in shock. We should move him to somewhere safe. Lynn, listen to me. Pull yourself together. You need to lead us when the captain isn't around. Stop it. You don't get to order me around. Wait a minute. I, I, uh, all I meant was that... Both of you. This is not the time for such foolishness. We can do both. Get the child to safety and continue searching for the other... You have my gratitude. If you hadn't come along... It was reckless to wander around a dangerous place like this. 
I didn't have a choice in the matter. The people are starving. I was foraging for food in the snowfield when the monsters attacked. I would have made it out if I was alone. But then who'd protect the people here? Wait, if you were wandering around the snowfield, did you happen to see the Boris tribe's hideout? Hmm. I have an idea where they might be. I'd like to return the favor and guide you there. All right. Let's hear this good idea. It's impossible to take down the entire Boris tribe without an army, but you can wipe them out all at once with an avalanche. If I recall correctly, above their base is a giant statue. Let's blow it up. It just so happens I have a bomb ready to go. I engineered it myself. This will definitely cause an avalanche. Okay, then I'll go. You guys stay and keep them distracted. Lid, it's dangerous to go alone. No, we'll get caught if we go together. I want to prove that I can do this alone. So trust me. Fine. Alone it is then. Same old Lynn. Once she's made up her mind, no one can change it. Now hold on. You're gonna need better gear. Just wait a moment. Tumania. Oh no. They don't. The bridge is the same storm. right. What do we do, Lynn? Well, we can't give up. We'll have to find another way. What's this stone tablet? I think it has ancient text written on it. The holy land of spirits. The frozen land. What? What do you mean? That's... what this tablet says. You mean... you can read ancient writing? Well, not exactly, but... I can see what it is. This child... so... so intriguing. There are letters etched on it. I can read this one, too. My little son, light of my life, please grow up healthily and well. What is this? It reads like something a parent leaves for a child. Len, what are you doing? Come here. Huh? Mom? My sweet girl, you've been through so much. Mom! You are all right? Yes. It's all right now. You can give everything up and come with me. But you... You told me to find Rudy. What about the mercenaries and the people? Lynn! Watch out! That's not Eileen! Well done, Lin. You did amazing. Ha <laughs> ha! Just as I thought. That really was some avalanche, right? And as a thank you for saving me, I'm gonna help you all out. For the time being. I heard an explosion. Explain yourself this instant! We took care of the Boris tribe by causing a huge avalanche. It should be What did you say? What are we supposed to do if the survivors come seeking revenge? Don't worry about it. We'll just take care of them then. Please, there's not enough to eat, and there's nothing to be found here either. Sorry to interrupt, but there are many who are wounded. I need herbs to heal them. Can you help? All right. Yeah, we'll help. Are you the heroes from Rosenbaum? What? How do you know who we are? I have been waiting for you at Noho's request. Noho? Who the heck is that? 
More importantly, how do they know where we are? That is a question for Noho. I have been instructed to lead the people you are traveling with to Ice Castle. Did you say Ice Castle? That's the stronghold where Spike of the Seven Knights once ruled. Len, let's see if we can ask them for more details. However, the Ice Castle should be safe enough for people to stay in. Hmm. We can't go searching for Rudy just yet. We need to find a place for the people to shelter first, understood? All right, let's return to the campsite. The, the forest tribe attacked! I can't believe it! How, how could this have happened? There may be survivors. We have to look for them. Save me! I beg of you! Hey! What went on here? The, the forest tribe attacked us because of you! We didn't stand a chance. They said we were fresh meat. They tried to eat us. What? Hang on. You're saying they literally eat people? Hmm. It's probably because they don't have a choice. We need to save them. Tell me, where were they taken? I saw the Boris Tribe Fortress on the way here. Maybe there? What? Then let's go! Hurry! What? You're really going? This is madness! We should run away ourselves! You absolute coward. You would do well to keep your thoughts to yourself. <laughs> That's ironic. Who was the one who said we should find our own ways to live? Shut up! That's not the same thing at all. People's lives are at stake here. You there! Lead the way and hurry! Thank you. You saved us. I knew we could count on the Daybreak yeah. person. This whole ordeal is all your fault to begin with. What did I say? I told you the survivors would come for us. You stirred them up. Oh, I've heard just about enough. You pathetic worm. I'll end you where you stand. Cade, knock it off. We're the ones who are responsible. Uh, mark my words. You'll regret this. Everyone, there's a castle nearby that we can stay in. So that's where we're going. All of you, please follow us. What? Persistent bastards, aren't they? Mercenaries! Let's protect the civilians! The coast is clear! Let's go! Harry, just a bit more! Oh, okay. There really is a castle! Whoa! Finally, out of the way! Uh, you bastard! I'm first! <laughs> Humans! Kill all of you! <sighs> Pathetic weakling. I'll go on ahead. Uh, wait for me! ordained from the beginning. Lady, I will always have your back. Thank you, Adele. Can you stop the nonsense and pay attention? Of course. I'm always paying attention. <laughs> this is getting old. What was that? I'm 
always watching your back too, Adele. N no, what I'm saying oh is... Oh my, how embarrassing. Uh, Claire, wait for me! The move. I've been waiting for you. You must be the people mentioned in the prophecy. You have amazing timing, of course. I don't put much faith in musty tomes and hokey religion. Adele, behave. The prophecy has never been wrong before. I trust it. Prophecy? What do you mean by that? Where is no hope? Please, excuse us. We are the Elder Krupp. Noho is looking for a way to purify the castle inside the Library of Time. I'm sorry. We'll have to meet up with Noho later. Right now, we need to look after the people with us. Please wait. I'm still worried about the injured. It's not much, but I'll give you some of the Saintly Order's supplies. Here. I gathered some firewood. Thank you. Everyone. Is your business concluded? Hmm. Please, take us to Noho. I shall guide you to the Library of Time. We'll be moving quickly, so do try to keep up. Strange. Something's here. I feel like it'd be stranger if nothing. But I wouldn't worry about it. I'm sure we can handle any enemy who comes our way. Except Gelu, the ice golem. We would be wise to avoid that beast. Gelu? You mean the legends we've been told all this time were true? Yes, Gelu was once the guardian of Lania, but it has been tainted by the power of destruction and turned violent. Fine, if something happens, I'll leave the miracle of purification to you. Can you handle it? Uh, yeah, but I... <laughs> Aha! So that's how it works. Uh, hello? What are you doing? Did you call us here for a reason? Good. I knew it would turn out this way. We have to activate the Elven Core. Please follow me. When the device is working, the Elven Core will appear. The Elven Core is the energy which moves the castle. Because we are not the owners of the castle, the Guardian Gelu will appear and attack us. And that's when Fine has to purify Gilu, is that right? That's right. But keep in mind, there's no telling what will happen when the device activates. <laughs> this again? Ugh. Really no hope. Ugh. How many times has this happened? That part of the text wasn't very legible, so I couldn't translate it. Now please, activate the device on the right first. Those who rule the castle, without permission, shall be eliminated! It's definitely corrupted! Fine! We could use your purification miracle! Purification didn't work as planned. This was unexpected. Then, what should we do now? If purification is not an option, then we need to take Gelu down any way we can. What? He's the guardian of the castle. Are you sure we can? When the castle is purified, Gelu will be resurrected in its original. I'll look for a way. Please wait. Fine, are you all right? Seems like something's bothering you. Every time I've used my powers, they're 
frightening eyes looking for me. They're getting closer and closer. I can't. These frightening eyes you spoke of, I imagine they must be the eyes of someone who is using ancient magic. Whoever is searching for you is an incredibly powerful being. Oh my goodness, you must have been so scared. I'm sorry, I didn't know. We can avoid being seen if we're able to use concealment magic. The saintly order has these secrets in safekeeping. Once we return there, I'll look for a way to access them. All right. Thank you, Melissa. I'll leave it to you. Where the hell have you been? The monsters attacked! If it weren't for us guards, all the refugees would have been killed! What the hell? What is this coward on about? How dare you? What's your tongue around the guard, Captain? <laughs> you useless mercenaries! Hurry up and purify the castle! You're continuing to put everyone's life in danger! The people have been talking. They no longer trust you to do your job. Enough! In the name of the Dawn mercenaries, I shall resolve this at once. I will not hear another word of objection. Hmm. We'll see about that. Has your business been completed? Yes. But, uh, can you explain to us what that weird tree there is all about? It's a tree which symbolizes the fate of elves, though its energy is being sucked away after being corrupted by the power of destruction. When the castle is purified, the vines will disappear and the tree will be healthy again. Also, I believe I've discovered a way to defeat Gelu. <laughs> we need Lania's crown. The artifact can be used to summon Gelu, but it can also suppress its power. However, Lania's crown was rumored to be on a ship that was unfortunately destroyed by guardian spirits. It is said that the wreckage is located somewhere on the lingering coast. Of course, there have been many attempts to find the crown. None have been successful. You see, elven artifacts cannot be found by those who do not own them. But if it's you, the ones mentioned in the prophecy... Got it. The lingering coast, you say? We'll go at once. Hey, aren't you the spirit who's working for Noho? The pirates kidnapped my spirit friends! It must be the North Sea pirates. They've been causing trouble in the area. They put my friends in cages. We need to find the key to save them. No problem. We can rescue your friends and search for the shipwreck at the same time. So this is Lania's actual crown. My goodness, you've done it! You found Lania's crown! Ugh, it was terrible. That ghost ship was something else. Excellent work. I will begin preparing the rite. Please remain here until it's... Melissa, what is it? The Saintly Order has a ship coming into harbor nearby. I'm going to make my way down there right away and ask them for their assistance, alright? Wait! With all those pirates around, it's too risky. I'll be fine. I am more than capable of protecting myself. And besides, the Ice Spirit will accompany me. So please do not be concerned for my safe... I know a shortcut to the harbor. With any luck, I should also be able to obtain a concealment spell scroll for Fine from the ship's supply. So, when everything is done here, I do sincerely hope you'll come with me to Carnia. I'm not sure if I... Oh, you mean the Holy City? That's the one. Given the saintly order of Carnia's ability to gather information, we should be able to find a clue to Rudy's whereabouts. Wow, really? That would be a spectacular help. Thank you, Melissa. Then I'll be on my way. And I'll make sure to share all the details as soon as I return. The rite has been prepared. I will begin purifying the castle momentarily. When the purification begins, Gelu will attack like last time. Lania's crown will weaken Gelu, but it will attract all monsters in the area as well. Don't worry, Noho. It will not go like last time, I promise. Then I leave it to all of you. Now, let the ritual begin. I speak on behalf of Lania, queen of the land of blizzards. Assemble, I command you. This is 
getting pretty serious. They're coming! Be careful! Look who's finally here! The castle has finally been purified. It's all thanks to you. I'll keep your achievements recorded. The tales of your deeds will be preserved alongside those of heroes. And so the withering tree of the elves is burdened once more. Great! Then the people will be safe now, right? We now have a base of our own. We can restore the castle and protect our people without any worry. Melissa, the wounded are in danger. No, Ho. Look after the people in the castle. You need not worry. Please reach out if you ever need our help. You there. Got a minute? I've been watching for a while. You seem like you're pretty handy in a fight. With skills like that, it ought to be easy to work with you. Sorry, work with me? You're looking for the priestess named Melissa, right? How did you... Who are you? Me? I'm Casper, the number one problem solver. And it just so happens that I'm currently employed by the pirates who kidnapped her. They asked me to pass along that they want to work out a deal with you. So if you want Melissa back, come with me. Melissa better be unharmed. Of course she's unharmed. But things will keep getting more and more dangerous for her if you keep stalling. She's quite the looker for a priestess of the saintly order. <laughs> you pig. What do you want? We recently had something called a tyrant's heart stolen from us. Go retrieve it for me, and then I'll release... And where exactly am I supposed to find that? It's all good, I'm on it. Only thing you gotta worry about is following close and helping with the fighting. Hey, Gambero! You're prepared to pay me, right? Oh, don't worry your pretty little head about that. Just go find it. Failure. I bet you don't know what a maniac our captain is. He was affected by a weird power at some point and started losing his mind. Right then. I suppose I'll forgive you. <laughs> but I still sentence you to death. I am If I don't get that thing back pretty soon, I'll be his next tough. What? You don't trust me? 
But I'm Casper, the number one problem solver. Okay, I'll be waiting for you down by the docks. <laughs> Aren't you the Dawn mercenaries? Oh, you're the guard captain's men. What happened? Pirates wearing black bandanas attacked us while we were on patrol. That's right. They were spotted at the coastal guard post, and now they're here. Hold on. Where is this guard post? You'll see it past those twin boulders to the north. Sounds like as good a place as any to start. Who are you? You're mercenaries? That's us. We encountered your patrolmen. They were attacked by pirates. They should be making their way back with the wounded soldiers. Oh, damn it. I knew this would happen. If only the captain wasn't so careless when he sent us out here. The thing is, over the last few days, those pirates have been showing up at the northern snowy uh, mountain. Wait, the mountain, you say? <laughs> I suppose that's the reason they couldn't be found on the shore, then. Pirates in the mountains, huh? All right, then. To the northern snowy mountain. You... the problem solver. Did Gigantus send you? You were with Kongero, weren't you? Did something happen between you? <coughs> He's no longer the Kongero we used to know. After he got his hands on the tyrant's heart, he became sadistic. He killed many of his men and brought on the Boorish tribe in their place. He wasn't like this when I joined his crew. I tried. I tried to change his mind, but... I really couldn't care less. Tell me, where is he? Beyond that hill? My subordinates weren't able to make it out in time. <laughs> Please... Save them. <laughs> Good. We have all the intel we need. What do you say? Shall we solve this problem? Sure thing. But did you have to be so hard? <laughs> I guess you are still only a child. There's no need to waste your emotions on these things. All right, enough talk. Let's move. After all, it's only a matter of time before they sell Melissa off to the highest bidder. Damn it. Please, Melissa. Hang in there. Hey, Stop. you're not playing Stop something it. fishy, I won't are you? Don't Please. worry. I hey. always keep my hands Snap out deal. of it. Huh? Hi, uh, who are you guys? It doesn't matter. Just save me. I'll do anything you say, please. It's simple. Tell us where Kongero is. We'll kill him for you. All you gotta do next is run away. <gasps> okay, sure. You just have to go down the hill and, and take the road to the. <laughs> Tyrant's heart? There's an inscription on it. It says, to my little son. <laughs> I can sense how powerful it is. The power is quite strong. Who was the owner of this artifact? You must have heard of him. It's Seven Night Spike. A legendary and powerful man. Wait a minute. If that's true, this is more valuable than I thought. As promised, we brought back everything the traders stole from you. Ooh, good, good. You guys are pretty useful. Hope you haven't forgotten your end of the... Of course not. She's on this ship. You can take her. <laughs> All right. But if you touched one hair on Melissa's head, I swear I'll make you pay. Yeah? You want to try me right now? You better take her before I change my mind. All right, I'll go get her. Melissa! Melissa, we're here! Lynn, wait. Something's not right. Hey, don't worry. You've got me here. Uh, Melissa! Huh? Works.
looks. Ooh, impressive. Oh, Lynn, are you all right? Uh, yeah, I'm glad you're safe. Lynn, why would you do that? Because you're, you're our final hope. Lynn, are you okay now? You were lucky. It could have turned out a lot worse. Yeah, sorry. Didn't mean to make you worry. I'm fine now, really. Hey, problem solver. Do you honestly think we're gonna let this slide? How could I have possibly known that pirate Gambero would pull a fast one on us? Regardless, I'm still on board to save the priestess. We don't trust you anymore. Why should we believe you? I don't know. Maybe because we problem solvers have our own rules. An eye for an eye, a betrayal for a betrayal. Thing is, I'm the one who knows where they keep their stolen goods. I'm thinking we should sneak aboard their ship and hide among the cargo. Damn that brat Gambero. I'll make him pay if it's the last thing I do. How dare he have the gall to try to kill me? All right. Listen, we'll trust you one last time. So lead the way. What are you waiting for? Kill them all! Ready the cannons! Ready, aim! Fire! You're going to get us killed too? You'll pay for lesson. deceiving the trouble shooter. This is shooter. what you get. Now annoying. Trouble shooter. I'll kill you all. Hurry. Wait, what are you trying to do? Sink that ship. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm going to protect you, Lynn. Fine. Here, this is yours. Uh, you're giving it to me? Lynn, it's okay. I don't feel the power anymore. You don't? <laughs> That's almost disappointing. So, uh, does this make up for my previous mistake? Yeah, you're not such a bad person after all. If you ever have a thorn in your side, come find me. I'll make sure to offer you a healthy discount. So long. All right. The ship is now ready to head towards Carnia. By the way, what are these things over here? They are valuable flowers, called red ice. 
I was afraid they were taken by the pirates, but thankfully they're all safe. Len, as I was telling you before, the saintly order has many priests dispatched to each and every region. Because of that, you should be able to find more information on Rudy and Carnia. Len, I think we should head over there next. I just know we can trust the saintly order. Agreed. Melissa has certainly earned our trust at this point. Fine, are you okay with it? Rudy? <gasps> Fine! What's the matter? My child. My child. Your existence. Fine, talk to us, please. I just remembered something. That's good, it means your memories are returning. What did you see? What are these memories? Not here either. I will find you. And I will destroy you. Go! It's time for your punishment. We're ready, ma'am. Mm. Let's begin. These what? sandy winds are bad for my skin? I had a pressing matter I needed to attend to. Please, give this observation log to the bishop. He gave me orders to take the miracle child. Oh, what a bother I'm telling you. I'm gonna go on ahead. Wow, Melissa! Is this Carnia? So many fascinating things! Oh, uh, Len. Not yet. This is the Three-Tailed Fox's oasis. The capital of Carnia is on the other side of that desert. We should rest up here, though. We have some time while the red ice is being prepared. Please help us. They've taken all the red ice. I'm not sure I understand. Why is... Because... It's required to make the saintly orders holy water. Our sacred elixir gives the people of Carnia peace of mind. So please, help me retrieve the red ice. It's a torch. Like some kind of beacon. And there's writing on it. The honor of Agni will defeat the darkness, and the flame of purification will never die. Wait a minute. I know what this is. It's a magic torch called... Long ago, there was a distinguished family here known as the Agni. The details are lost to time, but we know the head of the family was named Rachel. At some point, she went missing, and the Agni family quickly crumbled. But seeing that the fire still burns, perhaps... There might be a surviving member of the family out there. That flame is said to represent the fate of the Agni family. What? There's nothing here! It looks like the red ice has already been taken. If the stragglers are here, they couldn't have gotten very far. Then let's hurry after them. We drove them all away. Phew. I was scared, so I was hiding. We're looking for something that was stolen. Perhaps you can help? Have you seen any suspicious individuals nearby? Suspicious humans, you mean? We saw some in the temple. We are the Rai, travelers of the world. We heard there was an ancient temple here, so we came to look for treasure. But those people I mentioned were really scary looking, so we turned around and came back here. They call themselves the Holy Liberation Army or something like that. What? Liberation Army? Where is this temple? Go around the corner on the right and you'll see it. 
I see red ice on the ground. It's here. It must be hidden behind this door. If I were to guess, I'd say we need a key with the same shape to open it. Let's search the temple. I'm sure there's a way. Mine, this is ancient text too. Can you read it? Those who step inside ancient times, what you can see with your eyes is not everything. Distinguish truth from lies. Designed to eliminate intruders. The leader, Juju, should have the real one. Come to think of it, Juju wasn't at the temple. Where do we find her? <laughs> I'll find that witch for you. I'm sure I can help. Henry, what in the world are you doing here? <laughs> oh, my, my, Melissa. So you lost the red ice. I'm very disappointed in you. I'm... I'm going to get them back. Unfortunately, my dear child, the bishop says he can no longer trust you. So you'll be taking your orders from me. I'm going to whip up a special concoction to lure Juju to us. I will need your help, though, gathering ingredients from the desert. I shall be waiting for you by the town entrance. Who is that weirdo? His name is Henry. He's with the Dark Clergy. We'll help him for now, only since the bishop has ordered me to. <laughs> brother! My poor big brother! <sighs> I have an older brother who is half barbarian. He went out to the desert a few days ago, and I haven't heard from him since. I'm certain the Boris tribe must have kidnapped him. Please find my brother. His name is Sarder. Oh, you poor thing. It appears the Boris tribe have resorted to kidnapping children now, too. We can't even live our lives because of them. Please help. And worse, they've recently started attacking merchants and other travelers who've come to the Oasis. The town will be abandoned at this rate. Please defeat the Boris tribe. Is he one of the Boris tribesmen? No, I'm not part of the tribe. I'm only half Boris. Half barbarian. Wait, are you Esmeralda's brother by chance? Yes, that's right. Um, how do you know? She said you were the Boris tribe's captive and asked us to rescue you. Oh my goodness. She made a rash decision again, didn't she? I've been discriminated against in the village, constantly bullied for the supposed sin of being a half-breed. I left the town for my own happiness. My sister says that it's all for me, but she just demands that I follow the teachings of the saintly order. She doesn't try to understand. I can't do it anymore. Please, if you see her again, tell her not to look for me. He must have had it rough. I feel badly for him. That figures. Humans have the bad habit of distancing themselves from those who look different. That's because they haven't been properly taught the ways of the order of the saints. I should work harder. ...to spread their holy teachings. The Centauros village is up ahead. The crimson flower cactus can be found within. It is a holy plant, treasured by the villagers. Please bring it back to me. They will put up a good fight, though, so it should be fun. <laughs> Nicely done. I've finished the holy water thanks to you. Hold on. Don't tell me we did all that just for some holy water. Correct. However, this is a special type of holy water. One with a fragrance that spans great distances. Once Juju realizes it's here, she'll come running. Juju yearns for this. The holy water of the saintly order. And that sweet elixir is right here. All shall praise! This incredible fragrance! It's holy water! Karen's blessing is in the air! 
Oh, the great blessing of the saints. Oh, getting rid of the boorish tribe and making the place smell of holy water. Oh, you are all ambassadors of the gods, blessed by Karen. Oh, glory to the order of the saints, glory to the miracle of the holy water. Oh, oh that sacred aroma. We met your brother, and here's the thing. Sarder wasn't kidnapped. He said he left of his own will because of how he was treated for his mixed blood. Hmm? My brother is such a fool. It must be that boorish blood that makes him so stubborn. Oh, if only he followed the teachings of Karen, he would have been happy. Ah, oh, stupid Sarder. May he ever be blessed by the saints. stench reeks of chemicals. <laughs> My plan was a success. I will avenge those poor lost souls. Breath of the desert. I, Juju, who obeys the will of ancient times, commands you! Eliminate those evil beings! of the desert i choose you who obeys the will of ancient times commands you stop uh... go cast on juju why did you do this <laughs> you fools you're all being tricked if you knew the truth behind the Order of the Saints, you'd regret it immediately! Silence, you filthy heathen! I did... the right thing, didn't I? Thank you. We got the Red Ice back due to your efforts. If you'd like, I'll take you to Carnia now. Well, here we are. Huh? Melissa, there's nothing here. Oh, holy light! Shine down on our path! Oh. <laughs> there are hidden truths that the eye cannot see. This is Carnia, the great city of saints. Ah. Wow. Eternal blessings. I am glad to see you looking healthy, Priestess Melissa. Eternal blessings, Bishop. Reporting in from my journeys. This girl is the one. The miracle child. Ah, astounding. May you ever be blessed with Karen's protection. We're, uh, looking for Rudy. Will the Order of the Saints be able to help us locate him? So, you must be the one called Lem. Rest assured, 
My daughter Cosette will provide you with the assistance you need. Salutations. Welcome to Carnia. Mm, uh, uh, nice to meet you. Bishop, we've brought the captured heathens. We should throw them in the underground gyms. Can you not see we have honored guests? Get out of my sight! My, my apologies. <laughs> I'm sorry you had to witness that. Anyway, you must be tired after your journey. Uh, Priestess Melissa, please find them quarters where they can rest. Have the preparations been made? Yes, Bishop. We have readied the Dark Clergy as planned. I thought Carnio was the city of saints. So why are there people like them here? I don't know. This is... Len, be careful. I have a feeling someone's watching us. That surprise attack was only the beginning. Please follow me. What do you mean? Please, Cosette, tell us more. There's no time to explain. We must move before the enemy attacks. I don't sense any bad energy. What should we do, Len? We can't stay here like this. So for now, we should follow her. Alt! The forest is dangerous. The bishop has ordered us to stop anyone from entering. This is an urgent matter. Please, let us pass. I will take responsibility. We cannot go against the bishop's order. Not even for you, Priestess Melissa. Please, move along. Wow, what model soldiers they are, huh? Cade, were you like that back in boot? Stop fooling around, Luki. You need to prepare yourself. They're about to attack us. I'm asking you one last time. I implore you, let us through. No. If you come any closer, we will stop you with force. Rudy! I'm what is sorry that? that I got you into that this like dangerous maybe situation. Some kind of altar. That's okay. I hope we it's can find Rudy of after all this. The God of Darkness. Code How could something like that be in this Operation sacred forest? Operation Reconstruction. You're not going to get away with this. You are foolish to worship Elena. Nestra is our only hope for salvation. Currently, there's a growing number of followers who worship the goddess Nestra within the Order of the Saints. No, that can't be. That shouldn't even be possible. Especially with the light clergy here. I am sorry, but all your friends have been detained in the underground prison. Please, no. That place is only meant for the worst types of criminals. Serena, my word. Why are you locked up in a place such as this? Ugh. It's all your fault, Melissa. All because you told me to take that stupid letter to the bishop. I dropped it off in his office, but as I was leaving, I overheard him and Henry conspiring. The holy water is a drug, a drug created with a destruction stone and red ice. That's what they've been using to turn people into puppets. Oh my. Are you sure? Terrible things will surely happen if that power is used recklessly. So that means Juju was telling the truth? <laughs> Sound. What is it? It's an arena. They're bringing in a captive today, the leader of the Liberation Army. Hang on, their leader? That's Juju! She was captured because of us. We cannot let her die. Let us hurry and save her. Uh, I don't want to be alone. I'm a bit scared. I would rather go with you. The Hermit Swordsman? Who is that? He is the champion of the arena. Oh, yeah? The Hermit Swordsman. Sounds like there's a story behind that. You were horribly mistaken. What are you guys doing here? You listen to your warnings. Juju! Save we'll your you apologies. It's too late. Do you realize how many people have died because of you? I wish we could turn back time, but we can stop others from dying. Give us a chance. I'm not in a situation where I can refuse your help, so I'll accept it for now. 
But I will never forget what you did and the suffering you caused. Cosette, you traitor! Don't you realize how much the bishop loves you? Threat detected. Fire. Threat eliminated. This cannot be! Who set? We will now begin the operation for the cultivation facility. The facility is located inside the Forest of Illusion. Please lead the way. We must stop the bishop's evil deeds. Uh, no, wait! You need to get me to a safe location first. I mean... I'm Carnia's greatest singer. You wouldn't dream of leaving me in this dreadful place? At this rate, there will be no fans left to listen to your singing. Please, Serena, come fight by our side. Mm, I had a feeling you were gonna say that. Coming here without warning and causing trouble, you're all quite rude. Cosette will have to come with me to the altar. She'll have to beg her father's forgiveness. That girl is a witch! She is evil and must be purified! Evil! 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 Purify all who would follow the darkness! My beloved daughter, everything I do is for you. Cassette! Remember what I told you. You have to stop using your powers like that. But I... I just... wanted to protect everyone. Mine. Once broken, concealment spells cannot be cast again. Please, Mine. You must be more careful from now on. Okay. I'll be careful. What are we to do if they make it all the way here? Please have faith in us, Bishop. Indeed. After all, humans are we. This works in our favor. We should eliminate Fine right here. Yes. Agreed. We cannot let it end like this. I must find a way to turn my daughter back into a human being. Cosette, this is all for you. Now is the time for you to unleash your power. Now fight. Fight with us. The chance of success for this operation is approximately 2.5%. It is recommended. Such impudence! If you refuse to obey my commands, then you are my daughter no longer! This relationship has ended. Authorization is no longer approved. Switching to autonomous mode. It's them! Cosette, stop them at once! <sighs> what? What are you doing, Cosette? This relationship has ended. Authorization is no longer approved. 
In the name of Elena, you will suffer divine punishment! <laughs> Foolish humans, you shall receive the heavenly blessings of Nestor. Can't be. Come back! You have to fulfill your promise! Situation resolved. Huh? What did he? Grab him! Cosette, I will never give up on you! My mission would not have been possible. Thank goodness. Though, I should tell you, that's not why we're here. Secret code 04E. Carnia restoration complete. Sharing information regarding Rudy. They call him the Hermit Swordsman. He is in the waiting room of the underground arena. I have a new objective. It is to track and pursue the bishop. Len, I wish you the best. So... The Hermit Swordsman was Rudy. What? <laughs> the Bishop has fled, my lady. As I expected. <laughs> Have you found her? Possibly. But I would like to be certain. If you are deceiving me, you will die. <laughs> Might be fun to see you try. <laughs> <laughs>